what's up YouTube? In today's video, I'm gonna do a quick review on this awesome smart socket. This is what it looks like here. If you'd like more information on this amazing product, check out the links down in the description below. But this is what it does. Basically, it enables you to connect with your um, phone or Alexa. Alexa, turn off TV one. Okay. Alexa, turn on TV one. So it allows you to connect to, okay. I don't wanna say the name, to your Amazon device. So you can turn on devices such as your smart TV by plugging it into the wall first, then plugging the TV into the outlet of the smart device. So this is what it looks like here when you look at the manual. It's a company called Tekken, and this is what it's called. It's called Smart Socket SP10. These are the specs here. And also, if you wanna check out the reviews on this product, I'll left a link down in the description below. It has amazing reviews on it. So these are the basically the steps that you have to do to add this device to um, Alexa. Let me show you real quick. Whoops, I said her name again. Mm -hmm. Oh no. So this is for the Google device, which you can also do. This is how you set it up for the um, Alexa app. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna show you how it works, we're gonna get right into it. I actually bought just a pack of four, and um, basically I want to be able to talk to Alexa to turn on the TV there, and I have a few lights that I would like to come on and off um, with my mobile app. So I want that light to be able to come on, and the lights in the bedroom too to come on. All right, let's get right into the setup. It's really easy. All you have to do is take it out the box, plug it into your wall outlet. It doesn't matter which one you put it in because even though you set it up over here, you can move this device to another outlet and it'll still work and you can recategorize it and label it. So stick it into the wall. It'll light up like that. You want it to blink rapidly. And if it does not, then you just hold it down for about five seconds and it'll start blinking. So next step is you want to have the Smart Life app right here. And I already have a few of these plugs set up already. And you're going to hit this top corner here where it has a plus sign. And you're going to select uh, electric outlet. And it says right here, make sure the device is uh, blinking rapidly. And so it is, so you hit confirm. And then it already has my network all saved in there already. So you select that and then it doesn't take very long for it to connect. And I also have a Echo Dot back over there. So once it confirms, it's going to notify me that it's all set up. So this is it right here. And I'm showing you real time how long this takes to set up. It's really quick. Smart Socket 4, and you so, can control it by saying, turn on Smart Socket 4. That was really quick. And like I said before, all you have to do is just select the different name for it right over here, and then you can categorize this device um, to be in the living room, kitchen, study room, what have you. So this Smart Socket 4, you can change it to, I will just call it plug, save, and that's how fast you can do it. We'll just call this uh, the dining room and then you're going to hit complete and you're all done. And the way it works is whenever it's on, it'll show this little white icon here and then this little corner here turns blue. When you push it, it turns on and off. So you can see on the phone it's kind of dim and then this is off. That means that the plug is off whenever you tap it it turns white and this turns blue and there's no lag at all literally when you tap it it comes on and off that quick I'll show you one of the plugs that's already been set up really quick um, so you can see I have this one set up to where I can use my um, Alexa app or I can use my Echo Dot and say Alexa turn on TV one okay so it's turning on my Philips TV right now. Really easy to do. It does take a little while for the TV to come on, but it's always that way. It 
So TV's on as you can see there, and I'll show you the plug for that one really quick. It is right back here. So if I want to turn it off, I can actually turn it off from my app on the Smart um, Smart what is it called again? Smart Life app. That's what it is. So you can click on this, and that turns it off, and you can turn it back on. Or you can talk to Alexa and say, turn off TV one. Okay. Just like that. Now let me show you another one. I have another one over here. This is just a little nightlight I use for reading and stuff at night. I have the plug over there and I will show you how that works. So it is, I call this one the living room light. So. I'm gonna get kind of close to it so you can see. I'm gonna tap it just like that and tap off of it. You can also go into the uh, Alexa app. So I actually recategorize the name of it instead of smart plug or smart outlet, I have it listed as living room light. So I'm gonna go and talk to Alexa and tell her to turn on and off the light so you can see how it works. Alexa, turn on living room light. So as you can see, it's on. Alexa, turn off living room light. Okay. See how quick that works? Nice and simple and it works great. So if you're away from home or at home, you can turn it off without having to actually go over here and physically turn this little knob here. So call me lazy, but I do love convenience. So I do highly recommend these devices. You can buy them. Um, in a pack of two, four, um, and they look just like this. And we'll go into this room here, and you can tap Alexa on here. Alexa, turn on nightlight. Okay. So this one I have it set up the same exact way. All you're doing is just setting it up and putting the plug, I don't know if you can see that, but I have the plug back there and I like these so much I only bought four but I'm actually going to buy some more of them so I can just make this whole place uh, smart so this is the uh, night light on that quick really easy to do all right I just want to show you all how this thing works when you're away from home I am miles away from my home right now. I'm actually at the Grand Theater. And so I am on the LTE network and I have no Wi-Fi. And this is inside one of my living rooms here. I'm gonna show you the little lamp there. I'm not sure if you can see that. Let me point it to you real quick. This lamp right here, pay attention to that lamp because it's off right now this one right here I'm about to turn it on from my phone so let's go on here I'm going to go on to the smart life app and then I'm going to turn on which one is it living room light so I touch that when it turns green that means it's on and I'm gonna go back up to my ring app and the light should be on turn it back this way so you can see it so now when we zoom in it's kind of hard to tell but the light is actually on I'll turn it off real quick turn it off let's go back over here Connect. See, see, it's off now. That's how that works. Hope you enjoyed this quick little review. If you like this video and know someone that can use it, definitely share it with them. And definitely be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And as always, thank you all for watching. Alexa, turn off smart plug. Did you mean smart socket? I mean smart socket. My bad.
Yes. Sorry, I didn't find a device named Smart Socket in my bed. <laughs>